So welcome to a wonderfully freezing day here at Chateau de la Lacelle. It is <laughs> absolutely freezing. Right now, the temperature's minus five. <laughs> it is, we've just checked. <laughs> and we've decided to come outside to yeah. do a video. <laughs> For you lovely guys. But we got some updates from the last video that we did with the walk around, because you've all said you want to see more buildings and that, and we were really confused about the what we thought was a pantry on the side of the building. Yeah, obviously Ollie has given us so many different um, ideas of what it could be. Yeah from uh, where they could sort of the cutlery, to a staircase, to a pantry, to a toilet, to everything. And we think we've got there with it. We think we know what it is. Well, you do. I do. I'm 99.9% certain now. Terry doesn't agree with me, but I know that when we dig it out, the pantry isn't an add-on. It's an original part of the building. The add-on is the wall to the wall garden. So that was a set of stairs because the old kitchen was in the basement directly under the dining room. That would have been where they came up and down with the food. And I know you don't agree with that, but the kitchen. No, it that is. was late. That, it wasn't. That, that, that it always, is. That, no, the it's kitchen not. There. That's a late, late add-on. It's not. That, that part, that's the main part. Of that's the from the 50s and 60s. We know that that kitchen was used in the 50s and 60s. We know that. But it's got a chimney in it. Yeah, it does. But so does the basement. The original. The original to original. To the manor house. But no, but the, that that was still used in the 1800s as a kitchen. Yeah. It's been a functioning kitchen. And you're not going to walk. You have to think about the, like, the, the logistics of it otherwise. You'd have had to walk out the kitchen, up two sets of stairs, in the set of stairs that takes you up at the bottom of the turret, and then round into the dining room. That doesn't make any sense. You'd have a set of stairs directly from the kitchen to the dining room and then that would make sense as to why they've panelled it all out made it all look lovely because that's going to be a used door well makes sense to me well, we still don't know we still <laughs> don't know but that's we will do some digging in the new year and we'll have a look at it properly but yeah. I, I, I'd put money on it that that was the set of stairs and that makes sense as to why there's a wall in the middle of it to, do you know what I mean a wall going up and then up that would make sense it does to me Just, it's not big enough I don't think it is but. It is. Anyway. One hundred percent. We'll we'll do this in the new year. So in today's one, obviously after discovering that, the little extension on the side of the shuttle leads straight up to this. this direct line with this. Which this is the original toilet, which yes. we got told, and then that lines directly up to where we barbecue areas now, which, which would have been the old cess. Yeah. So you can see obviously the the pipe underneath. Well, the hole. Yeah, there's a tunnel there and it's a perfect tunnel and again it's one of these tunnels like everything else it's built with the same stone yeah it's roofed it's built it's been done specifically for that for that yeah so like I said all of those three line up perfectly mm -hmm. so I know we don't know we don't know till we dig in it properly we'll we'll yeah, find out we'll find out but after this isn't a massive building we'll show you this and it's got exactly the same windows what that one had yep. and then what we're going to do is we'll go down to the old workshop yep. and we'll have a little look in there. That's probably, well, I wouldn't say it's the worst building because it's still got half a roof. <laughs> <laughs> it's one of the worst though and it's, it's, in a, it's in bad nick. So. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we'll go down there and we'll show you some of the bits in there because it's fascinating just looking at like... Some of the old machinery. Yeah, yeah, that's just been left there. Yeah. Um, and we've never, we've went in the door and had a little look but we've never actually discovered further in, have no. we? So... Yeah, we'll have a little look in there now. Yep. Let's come on the corner. So, here's our little building. So, our little latrine. <laughs> Again, we know this is the latrine because um, it's the only thing that makes any sense lined up to the cesspit. And we have been told, we thought when we initially got here, before we'd spoke to anyone, that it was like a little gatehouse, like a little door, like to, to welcome people in. It's yeah. not that. It's not. It's so, yeah. not exciting like that. No, but again, it's got old, old electrics in. So this has been used at a, like, more a, modern a time. Yeah. How cold would it if it's anything like it is now having to come out here and go and use the toilet? I couldn't have done it. I know. I'd have oh. peed my pants. As you can see, obviously, it's got oh. the little window, which is exactly the same as the one on the yeah, other building, the isn't there, it? Yeah. Um, it's got little... Little cubby holes in for the old candles, I'm guessing, that they would have had in there. Yeah. A toilet roll holder, I suppose. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, this would have been the old, old toilet. Um, there was a toilet in the basement as well, wasn't it, of the chateau? Yeah, but that was a lot later. That was an actual toilet. Yeah, um, which we have no idea where that goes either. No, um, that was <coughs> a, 
a proper parcel but again, we've just used this to store a load of kindling and, and wood right now because it's dry and it's fine. So, but yeah, we need to go in here and dig this one out at some point as well. well. I think the woman from when she came and visited, she said that, obviously she said, oh, just be careful and don't let Jonathan go in because it's just a big Straight drop, drop yeah. isn't it? Yeah. So well, you think about where we are here, yeah. to where the cess is down there. Yeah, where the actual cess is, that's going to be 10 foot straight down because yeah. it's just going to be a hole in the ground and it'll just disappear off. Must have stunk. I know. But yeah, but obviously in the room, there's not much to. Lots of free cobwebs. Loads of cobwebs, yeah. But it is just like a tiny room with the window, a little thing for. Is that a. Yeah, it's just a little cubby hole, isn't it? Toilet roll holder. <laughs> There's one over there as well. Yeah. Mm. Mm. And obviously you've got the old little light switch. On the light. Hello Robin. Come to say hello on the video. So yeah, obviously I don't know what we'd do with this in the future. It's a nice little building. It'd be good as a little den for Jonathan. Little den or again a little wood store because it gets dry and everything. We need to sort the roof out when I get some more tiles on it. But yes. Yeah, yeah. It'll do the cool. job. So to but show you, obviously there is the outbuilding that we discovered in the last video, which we'll put a link in for you now. And then straight along the wall is this little building. And we're just having the discussion there as well off camera that I think that this wall is a much later addition because again you wouldn't have walked the distance you have to walk to to walk around to this toilet if this wall isn't here it's a what eight meter walk if the wall is here it's a 25 30 meter walk minimum to walk around to the loo and I think this Terry thinks it was built up to the wall and I think that it was before the wall yeah. just makes more sense I still think that it was some sort of I think it was a sort of like split I don't know I, I don't know the I think it was some sort of toilet still because it lines up perfectly with this what's that yeah I, well the shadow we'll, owners we'll, we'll find out won't we the shadow owners would never have came this far to go to the toilet when you've got a grand house like that you wouldn't come outside no to go I'm to not the saying toilet. that this will have been for the maids and the servants yeah so where would your toilet be in the shadow you've got the toilet underneath right no, underneath that wasn't the there bottom. That but th there was no toilets in there. We've not found. There was one toilet. But in that's the got. This is a this 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 building has twenty four rooms. One of them was a toilet that was smaller than that. So that doesn't make any sense either because that can't have been where the original toilets were in there. They wouldn't have necessarily had plumb toilets in there. The times that we're talking about. No. That uh, well, again, you've got servants and maids that that are cleaned up with. Yeah. Cleaned but up after them. Anyway. anyway. So, going down to the barbecue area. Yeah. So, this, when we were clearing all this out. You found this? Yeah. Which is the old slipway the old cess and that makes sense and again look at this laid stone it's different and, yeah. that, and that's all i'm saying there's well a, there's that's a, fully lined like right the way yeah right through, isn't it top sides you can see right into it and as far but i've only gone in about a meter and a half yeah but you can see it's all like properly yeah it's been properly done it's not just a coincidence or a happy accident it's been actually done to do that, to drain the water out to here or to drain the, the cess out to here and this would have been collected however many times a year. Yeah, but obviously we know that so it was all definitely the toilet now because if you look from here, obviously the caravan's in the way but it lines up directly straight line. with the little building near the gate post there and then the other one and it comes all the way down here. Hey ho, you don't know. But anyway, obviously we've got this part, which was a later addition to discover. Yeah. And then we've got the outbuildings over there, which we can discover as well at yeah. a later date, can we? Yeah. 
obviously them ones I've got God knows how many different things looking at like oh, them as well haven't they? Yeah. The um, orangerie and the chicken coops are original original yeah. you can see that and I think well they have like hidden tunnels yeah there's a tunnel that them, goes right the way around the orangerie as well people are saying it's for heat and ventilation but I, again I, I personally don't understand that because the walls are two foot thick yeah uh, it doesn't matter what fire you build in that yeah it's really not gonna make yeah, much of a difference through two foot a wall yeah so yeah so them ones we can look at another later date yep right so we're gonna have a little look we're going in one. here um, so again we haven't really shown much of this building in time this is where Terry stores all his furniture no it isn't that one. Oh, that one yeah that one we can look at yeah we'll do again later again that's a beautiful building uh, but this <laughs> is this one I don't this is we really haven't done much in here other than keep stuff in and out the way Again, it's had electrics in here at some point. Yeah, obviously this was a massively later dated one, isn't it? Yeah. Again, it's been built with bricks, so. Yeah. Um, I'd say probably early. Well, it's a mixture, isn't it? If we look outside, like this, the bottom part's stone. the same stone. But it's but not the same as that. No, but then this part's all just brick. Um, which it's all very strange. We've got like a beautiful big trunk there yep and then obviously while we're restoring while well, come in like we're needing stuff like old screws so they don't look too new and tying in and obviously there's all of these boxes just full look at that old light switch <laughs> <laughs> I don't think we'll be using don't think that. that'll work again but stuff like the old locks and all that's like so many of these we were missing and it's good obviously that we've got them all still here um, some of the old tools, the old workbenches. Again, there's a hole in the roof here because it hasn't done great. So these have been getting damaged. But this is a old, old. See if I can get this off. Where is no. it? It's the old saw. It's in the old bench saw. You never seen it? No. I'll take this off. Two seconds. Uh, you know, bench saw. Oh my god. <laughs> what like a pulley one? Yeah, well there's the, I'm guessing there's a belt, belt. that's dri driven it there. Yeah. I can't see anything down the other side. No? The belt obviously driven it there, there's been some sort of motor here to drive that. And that's been the old soft where they've done any of the woodworking in here. Mm. I've never actually been this far over in here. No. I'd spotted that from the door. And then, is that for the old fence posts? Yeah. To be used to knock the fence posts down. No, that looks like it screws in the sink. It's got a thread on it. So it might have been a wine sink. Hey, you want me to brave it? I'll have a little look. Go on then. I'll wait underneath ready to catch you. I'll show you that. Again, these stairs aren't in the greatest of nick. I think it might be better walking up the uh, handrail. <laughs> is the handrail more solid? Yeah. yeah. To be honest, the main part of the stairs is. Shall I take you up? Do you want to go up? <laughs> so we have never, ever. No, you're seeing this for the first time, as same as we are. Gone this far up. Oh God. There's lots of tubs up here. Lots of more stuff for horses. I think so, yeah. I don't think it was actually. No, it might have just been like to store 
more the horses stuff because there's another saddle thing there. Obviously, unfortunately, all of the roof has come down on this side, and that had come down before we'd even got here. Well, luckily, we've got all the tiles. <laughs> but to be honest, this, the, the main part of the stairs, considering the damage. this is what I'm stood on, yeah. <laughs> it's all alright. And all good. And obviously, this ivy is what's causing all of it, which is an absolute nightmare to get off. The roots on it are crazy, aren't they? Yep. Like They're how big they are. Arm. Yeah. They're as thick as your arm. Yeah. <coughs> but yeah, I don't. Okay. Yeah. Oh, going further up. Obviously, still no treasure up here. No. We haven't found anything, but at least it's another space that we've looked at. Obviously, we. Now that there's now up here now, worth the value <laughs> that I can see. But I don't know, I don't know what the plans were for this. Ash, are they for the future? We God knows. No, like the views looking out are amazing. I think at one point we said it would be nice just to have like as a keep the roof off and have to come and sit up here. Um, yeah, 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 a bit like a veranda or balcony. I'll quickly show you the views now, obviously, from out of the roof. <laughs> so, looking out, obviously, you can't really see because it's so misty and foggy. But the trees, and then straight after that, you've got all of the hills and just French countryside. And it's just amazing just looking out. So, yeah. But I will pass you back down to Ash now while I attempt to try and get down here without killing myself. Oops, here we go. <laughs> so, yeah, oh, so he's the ledge's very small, like I don't know how <laughs> <laughs> used for midgets. <laughs> so, yeah, here's the old saw, obviously, not connected. Here's the old pulley. Again, not going to do much now. I think it's as seized as it's ever going to be. But again, there must have been some sort of mortar down there. And you can see the underside of the blade under there. So it has been used. It's been a, used, it's been a working workshop. There's Terry's big old trunk that he loves. Yeah, I haven't even looked in that yet. But even like the workbench, as I've seen, you've got this big massive workbench. Yeah, at the end of it there, there's some that pulls out. I've just been while you were upstairs playing. Well, that's like vice, isn't it? Yeah. Hold stuff on and do working. Pull it no, pulls, pulls right pulls back as well. Yeah. Pull it in to wedge stuff in, so it's just yeah. like a big vice. So there's a big case there. Like I said, just all the stuff when you look up here and the stuff that's been hung up here God knows how many years ago. Well, we were looking at these, and I think, are these all the mole traps? Because mm. we found out, obviously, that got so many moles. Yeah, we have quite a few moles. Um, I think that's what someone said they were wearing there. I'm not sure, 100% sure what they are. Sure they, they Could are. well be. You put them in the hole and then... I wouldn't doubt it for a second, but again you've got all this old, old things up here. Like it's just all of the stories that, that this one had told. Drill. It's an old drill. Is it an old drill? Yeah. Yeah. I think it's going to work though. No. <laughs> Should have been good. <laughs> I'll stick to my Milwaukee, thanks. <laughs> but again, you can see the add on to this. Like, yeah. It's been built up to it. There's no, there's no connection. It's literally just been built up to this, and this this building here is our our barn, our function room, and everything else. And as a footprint on the land, the footprint of this building is bigger than the chateau itself. Yeah. But then, like, it is just a strange one. This one. And this side, you've got all the stone, which has been done. Like, yeah, it's been well. done lovely, but it's not the same. It's not the same as the the rest of the building. Stone. Yeah. So there's obviously always been some sort of building here, 
Yeah. But it's obviously changed over the years. Who knows? Who knows? But then obviously we've got the log store now, what it is. I think that's where they used to make the cider, wasn't it? Yeah, we've been Down told there. that this was a, a little cidery. Yeah. <coughs> and then on the other on side. On the other side, we've got the little stables, haven't we? Yeah. They're on that side as well. So it's good. Just shot. things that we'll discover in time. I think now we're we're a bit more settled and we've got somewhere to live and yeah, yeah, we yeah. can start looking at these things and, and do more vlogs about these things and discovering them and discover them with you. Like I say, that that is genuinely the first time we've been right into that building. Yeah, to and it's the it. first time you've been upstairs. Any of us have been upstairs, so yeah, you've I think seen that. The big part of the barn was showed at one point. Didn't yeah. We? But again the fascinating one and this is the outside so there's a building missing off the back here so as you look up this was the old bread oven well you can sort of can we pass it over to yeah yes you, know. you can talk it so when you see us in the function room the big mantle that goes through comes through the wall here's the the stones protruding out the back and this here would have came out into the bread oven and the doors and everything are still in there yeah and um, the hinges for the doors they've bricked it all up since but we've been trying to work out where that would have came to looking at well the walls are plastered for one yep <coughs> again there's been a building here of some sort because there's been, can definitely see. been a building here yeah well, there's obviously bricks down there of what was a building and then and again if you look up there look here look so this window is a later addition because you can see the old roof where the roof used to go out the back here yeah can you see it there mm -hmm. and then that comes down to about here so this looks like all of this here had a building on here yeah there was a big That's building on the back of here which would have been the, for the bread oven that window wouldn't have been there they might still have had the window because they had internal windows not in a bread into a bread oven you wouldn't that's where all the heat would have been yeah. so this would have been the actual oven itself where they put it in so that it came in to stoke it up and fire it underneath here but would they have had it to try and get some eat in for the animals? Because obviously in there then you've got but no, the stables. Not, it's where the roof would have came down to. Yeah, cutting it off. Across the roof lintel. And this is all newer. You look at this plaster and the way that this has been rendered, yeah. um, being pointed, sorry, it's exactly the same as what's down on the old. Yeah, but then on the other side of it, I see you've got that little window as well, which that one's definitely That's original. original. Yeah. yeah but then well, if you look up to the, the building of that window yeah it's different so there's been a building here of some sort of some sort and like I say we were told that this was the the bread ovens for the town of la la Salle itself because you can see the stones coming out up to there more modern stones but yeah it's been built up to and in there's been a building here yeah we know that we know that this was a bread oven we know that this burnt down as well yeah and this building completely burnt down in the 60s i think yeah i think we've been told it was the 60s rebuilt in the 70s and they've left the old burnt beams yes. in there which we absolutely love it's just a, a bit of character to the room isn't it something different yeah something to talk about so yeah obviously we've got Loads more buildings to discover. Yeah, there's loads of places in these buildings that we've never been to as well or never even looked in. So I think what we'll do is we'll let you have a look. We've looked at this. We'll have a chat with you. Leave you what you think in the comments and we'll come back and we'll discover more buildings in a future vlog. Yeah. Shall we quickly look in the one with the furniture, do you think? No. Why? Because we'll save that for another vlog. That's another vlog in itself, just that one room, Tess. It's Terry's Brockon. <laughs> <laughs> That was another fun look around it was obviously it's another vlog with more questions and answers we like them ones <laughs> gives us something to look forward to for the future really doesn't it to yeah investigate and just do something with do you think yeah but like i said obviously the thing with the the little square building mm -hmm. and the toilet mm -hmm. and the cesspit it just all leads to one thing for me but 
I know you are. Yeah, I don't think it was a toilet. I know, I know what you're saying, but I don't think it was. It just makes more sense to me that it was stairs. Yeah. And that, that's, that, that, that's the logic, just logically. Stairs to a toilet? Stairs to a kitchen, <laughs> a kitchen to dining room. <laughs> You still wouldn't, you just wouldn't know. <laughs> and like I say, we will dig that and I, I'll put money on that. I'm right on that one, that it was stairs down in the kitchen. We'll have to look. We'll see. We'll see. <laughs> but if you want to see the rest of the outbuildings that we've got, so we've got obviously this whole row here and then the orangery, which has got a tunnel around that as well. Yep. Obviously these ones here, they've got like doors that have been blocked up and yeah again it's been they, these it doesn't look it but they're quite big um, yeah and they were actually on two levels because there's doors at a level that we could never get to yeah so it's, it's obviously been significant it's been significant enough for them to well to do it yeah because yeah. the building work involved in putting doors in a wall like that and at the end when you see the arching and everything you see the architecture that's gone into it it's not just yeah. been like a an add-on or we'll just thought oh we'll just get this done yeah yeah, it's all been, everything here has been it's planned been, out. Yeah, it's all been thought out. Mm -hmm. And it's just trying to... And like, th this is, a right, again, these are original to the original building. So these are original to the 1750s chateau or manor house as it was before yeah. the turret. And it's just trying to work out, obviously, what everything was used for and why they were used. Yeah, why like, they were there. Why we've got a tunnel, like around the orangery. That makes no sense. No. It just makes none. No. And I can't understand because the orangery is probably what eight foot, nine foot below the ground. Again, yeah. that makes sense to keep it warm in winter. It was obviously all glass fronted. Mm -hmm. But then why build a tunnel around the back of it? That it, it's not vented. Nothing vents yeah. from inside into the orangery. Yeah. So just... it doesn't quite make any sense. I think someone had mentioned before it was for fires. But when you see the walls, the solid pieces of granite that are this thick. Yeah. I don't know at all. <laughs> and there's no burning in there either. No. It's, it's crazy but obviously if you want to see those put a comment in yep so we know obviously if people want to see more or if not and for now we will go and get warm yep and we will see you tomorrow see you tomorrow bye on the seventh day of christmas my chateau gave to me seven helpers helping six gates need painting five crazy brits Four caravans, three rooms are ready, two birds of beauty and a home for our whole family.